it is time. It is time to watch this. Well, this shit show. Here we go. Try get it on video. This young woman is being arrested, but she's not going down without a fight. Video Sam. To jail. You don't get to resist. Twenty-year-old Samantha Alonzo Luna and her friends were pulled over by cops near Humboldt State University in Northern California. One of them is arrested for sticking her head out of the sunroof. Samantha is not happy about it. Why are you being so rude? You're I'm the sorry. One that's being rude. I'm sorry that anyone You're the one that's you. being rude. How am I being rude? Seriously? You're about two seconds from going to jail for public intoxication. Uh -oh. Do you not understand that? So I would stop talking if I were you. Oh, but Luna shit. continues to argue with the Yo, the cop was like, yo, check this out. The cop, dude, the cop, the cop is like, check this out. The cop is like, check this out. Bitch, you finna go to jail. Apparently, she didn't. The cop. When I asked your last name, then you oh should That is my last name. Samantha Luna is my you last name. Luna. What's on your license? Alonso Luna. Then that's my what last you name is Luna. Me. The oh, cop here has we go. had enough. Here it is. Are you cop? No, I'm not getting out of the car. No, I'm not. You're going to jail. Oh, my God. Trent, no, what the Trent. You are going? What the Oh, yes. Trent, yes. get it on video. Trent, get it on I'm video. Hell yeah, she drag her ass out. by her hair. Oh, yes. Stop hitting her. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No, uh-uh. Drag, that bitch. Drag that bitch out. Drag that bitch out. tells the other officers to get some scissors and cut her hair. My oh, hair. my God. No, Seriously, cut my hair. Cut my hair. I don't care. What? Wait, hold on. Oh, I did not. Grabs the so she grabbed the officer's hair? You are going? What the? Try and get it on video. Try and get it on I'm video. Getting... She grabs the cop by her hair. Let go of my hair. Stop hitting Whoa. her. Oh, she grabbed the cop. Oh, my God. Oh my god. She grabbed the dude. Th dude. This guy. Hey, look man. Look. Look, check this out. White guys. White guys, this is on y'all. This is on y'all. Look man, I got a lot of I've got a lot of smoke for niggas. Like Chris Rock famously said, I love black people, I hate niggas on the same way. Love black people. I hate ignorant ass niggas like Obsidian and O'Shea. But white boys, y'all the reason, y'all are the reason for this. Y'all are the reason for this. We have, we have citizens assaulting police officers, regularly assaulting police officers. Holy cannoli, she grabbed her by her hair. Bruh. This is what needs to happen. Holy moly. She won't let go. So the cop tells the other officers to get some scissors and cut her hair. So they would not. Seriously, cut my hair. Cut my hair. She's like, cut my hair. I don't give a shit. We asked security expert Steve Cardian to analyze the video. Even if the police officers were wrong in arresting her, she has no right to resist arrest. It's a crime in the state of California. Luna was Jesus. charged with suspicion of public intoxication and battery on an officer. Oh, yeah. Check out her mugshot. She's smiling. She posted the videos on Facebook and blasted the cop. She had no need to act so unprofessional. She was seeking a reaction out of me. Oh, no. Bitch, you grabbed her hair. Get it on video. Try and get it on video. The university says it's investigating Miss Luna, who is not a student at the school, says she's going to file a lawsuit. Dude, she ain't filing no goddamn lawsuit. Anytime white girls... Anytime white girls get manhandled by the cops, they're always the first. They're always the first to uh, 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 threaten a lawsuit. Only fucking dude, only white girls. Only a white girl will assault someone, and then if they retaliate, then they file a lawsuit. That motherfucking cop yanked that bitch out the seat with the quickness. Holy cannoli. And then she smiled. Then she smiled at her mugshot. Wow. Wow. Holy cannoli. Wow. Uh, so the next police video that we are going to watch is, um, so this bitch got tased in a Walmart. She got tased in a Walmart. Let's take a look. The knife now! Drop it now! Oh, she's got a knife. Drop it. Okay, it says, Deputy White uh, responded to the report of a woman wielding a knife threatening people at Walmart on 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 South Highway 441, and he's telling her to drop the knife. The knife. 
Up the knife now. Do you see that? See what, guys, listen. What this all shows, what this all shows is women's lack of respect for authority. Women do not respect authority. Would you like to know why they don't respect authority? Because we allow them to get away with not respecting authority. This cop has a taser pointed at her. He is telling her, drop the knife. She looks relaxed like there is nothing, like, like nothing's going to happen. The other, the other bitch actually tried to get in the police car. Couldn't get in the police car, so she blocked up an intersection and literally squared up with the cops. Like, literally squared up with the cops. I'm trying to tell you, dude. Holy moly. Drop. Upon arrival, he locates uh, Brandy McCowan in the clothing section, branding a knife she opened in the store. Oh, boy. She Get is back. not budging. Back up. Drop the knife now. Drop it. Yo, he's about to tase that ass. Drop the knife. Drop the knife. Drop it now. Yo, that's it. Put it down. This bitch is asking Put to the get... knife down. He holds McCowan at gunpoint while waiting for backup to arrive. Oh, this is a gun he has on her. Wow. Put it down. Put the knife down. Look at how relaxed she is. Yo, I, look, man. I've had a gun pointed at me before in my life. I've had a gun pointed at me. What do you do? You put your hands in the air. This woman has a gun pointed at her. And she looks, dude, she looks as relaxed. She looks as relaxed that one could be as one could be trying to pick out a loaf of bread. She looks like she, she looks like she does not have a care in the world. This is unbelievable. Put it down now. Put the knife down. Put it down. Drop it. Drop the knife. He's told her now six times. Put it down. Put the knife down. Put the knife down. Drop the knife. Yo, drop this hoe, man. Drop oh, the whoa. knife. Detective Thomas arrives to assist, which provides Deputy Witted with the opportunity to switch to non-lethal force. There it is. Okay, now he grabbed the taser. Perfect. All right, there we go. Now he's gonna drop the knife now. Oh, <laughs> oh shit! Drop the knife. Oh my god. Yo, yo, the bitch. Yo, the bitch said. Boom. <laughs> oh shit! Watch this shit. He hit her with the taser. She said. <laughs> Drop the knife no, now. Watch this shit. Watch, 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 watch. Oh, that's it. That's a wrap. Drop the knife. Oh my god. All right, so I see a uh, so I see a, a a a leg tattoo and a tramp stamp. Oh. Oh my god. Hold up. Let me watch that one more time. That was funny as shit. She said. Drop the knife now. That's it. Do it. Yo, the bitch slid off the clothes. Drop the knife. Unbelievable. 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 Unbelievable, man. Wow. Holy shit. What a simp actually is ah uh, do you guys know what a simp actually is you know i'm glad 
I'm glad Sarah asked that question, guys. I actually did a video short. I did a video short a while back defining the word simp, defining what simping is. Simping is simple, guys. Simping is simple. Simping is giving a giving an undeserving woman access to your time, your energy, your attention, and your resources. Let me repeat that. Simping is a man who gives an undeserving woman access to his time, his energy, his attention, and his resources. Basically doing shit for women that don't deserve shit. That's what it is. Women that don't deserve anything. If you are doing things for one, a lot of people, a lot of people like to say, well, Donovan's a simp. He simps for Devin. No, I don't. Devin deserves what I give her. She absolutely has earned everything I have ever done for her. She do, she deserves it, so I do it. That is the definition of a simp. Let's continue. I've been one. <laughs> okay, go for it. Yeah, yeah, I've been one. So Female I've, simp. Okay, yeah, go yeah, for I've it. Yeah, myself. Big up my thing. So basically, in my experience, it's a simp that does way too much for someone that would never do the same for them. That's interesting. I like her definition. Someone that would do way too much for someone who doesn't do the same for them. That makes sense. I guess that could be an addition to the def the def the, the addition to the definition. Looks like old girl here right in the middle is very cognizant of where the camera is. That looks like a fuck me face, actually. But I love him though. <laughs> so you said a simp. Oh boy. <laughs> what is what is too what is too much? Like what did you essentially do? anything? Does this girl have a tattoo on her face? When you're a simp, you essentially shouldn't be doing anything for that person. Okay, so this woman, this woman has a tattoo on her face and lip filler and lip fillers. She belongs to the streets. Yep, that's obvious. So anything you do is too much. Mm -hmm. But you do as much as to think. People might say, "What is that?" Shout out to Ramiro. <laughs> Welcome to Chat Privileges. At Ramiro to welcome him to the TSR family. Ramiro, if you would, put your age and location in the chat. Ramiro also says, unfair exchange of value. I like that definition. I do. I do like that definition. That's very good. Yo, man. No, but I love him. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was just wondering, like, what is too much? Like, what were you doing? Okay, in my example, okay, he had a girlfriend. Oh, but that's still my whoa, that's whoa, weird. whoa, <laughs> hold on. She was a side bitch. She's a side bitch, y'all. She's a she 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 she's a side bitch. That's this woman's that's this woman's cross. She's a side bitch. She's simping for a man who is married. Ay, ay, ay. Hold <laughs> up. <laughs> so hang on, you're telling me that you, you had a guy who already had a girlfriend. Wow, Sarah speaks almost as loudly as I do. Let me turn that down a little bit. Yeah, there but we go. So what are you doing with him? That's my baby. A side chick, isn't it? Yeah. Basically. So basically, you're a side chick. Okay, so okay. There it is. I didn't know he had a girlfriend. So Stop the cap. No, you knew he had a girlfriend. That's why you were attracted to him. That's why you're attracted to him. Nothing, nothing works. Uh, uh, Pre-selection works very, very well on women who are consummate side bitches. Consummate side bitches. Yeah, yeah, but when you found out he had a girlfriend, you stayed with him, right? Yeah, yes, she did. that's my baby. So you that's my baby. got side chick wow. energy. <laughs> no. She's definitely but... a side chick. Yep. <laughs> You're a side chick. You're a side chick. <laughs> no, wow. no, side chick. Not in general, because I don't want people how to think that's how how I How can you say I'm not a side chick? chick when... I mean, you brought this up. <laughs> you brought it out. Like, <laughs> in, general, like, in general, mandem, if you're trying to wife me, don't have a girl. However, okay. him especially, because I didn't find out he had a girl for about, what was it, like two, it three was weeks? It a while. And wait, I thought, wait, wait, wait. That's it was like two Uh-oh, her girl is about, her, her girl's about to tell on her. No, 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 her girl's about to tell on her. Oh, no. Wait, just got wait, it looks like baby girl looking at the camera has tattoos on all. Looks like she's got tattoos on her all of her fingers. What? What are, wait a minute, oops. Wait, wait, wait. That's like too early. Wait, no, but see, no, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Wow, look at this. Let me lie. Let me lie. One at a time. One at a time.
Look at this. I mean, one time. Go on, go on, okay, go. let me This is me. unbelievable. See me, yeah? I'm the type of person that... Yep, there it is. She has tattoos on all of her fingers. Look at her right here. I'll point it out for you guys right here. See all them tattoos? Jesus Christ. I go with energy. So uh, haha, gotcha56, $10. Says, just wanted to let you know that you, Fresh and Fit, and Andrew Tate are doing an amazing thing, are doing amazing things for men and also for the women if they don't get stuck in their feelings. I appreciate that very much. Damien Orozco with the $2 Super Chat says, oh, here we go. I'll have to meet you in person. Uh, Beauty All Around says she knew. I think she knew, too. I think she's capping. This good energy, I will link you every day. So it's like, you know, like when you're in Love Island or Big Brother House, two weeks is like two months. So essentially, them two weeks was my two months. She's so, saying she loves the thrill. <laughs> I love the thrill. So the two weeks, so now we're pretending we're on reality TV to justify it? Come on. So in my head, I was like, yeah, this is my man. And oh, my God. Your man after two weeks. <laughs> All right, how long has it been now? How long, like, how long until you cut it off? She's oh, no, still... no, no, that's, that's... <laughs> Are you still with him? <laughs> I mean, She's it sounds like it. Bitch? She said she still loves him, so... So hang on. Oh, we my God. What the hell is going on here? When, <laughs> when did I meet him? So you're saying... Look, look how proud she is. Look, look how proud she is. One at a time. Let me just get Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Go on. A year, a year... So, okay, so let me just... So after two, three weeks... You found out he has a girlfriend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And instead of saying, you know what, I'm going to cut my losses and get out. No, no, no. You were like, nope. let me just ride this till I die. So yeah, she yeah, was yeah. not listening to the advice. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> so, now, so does, does the girlfriend know? Modern women. Oh, hell no. Of course no, no, not. No, no, no. Mm -mm. So the girl oh, and she has a, oh my gosh, she has a hand tattoo. Oh my God. Girlfriend has no idea. Bro, she's listen, a side chick. Okay, listen, listen, story. Story. listen, 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 listen. Trust me, I'm there's no other way about it. You're a side chick, you're a side chick, and you know that. I'll tell you what, man, these British guys, these British guys call these bitches out. He's like, you're a side chick, plain and simple. There's no other way around it, bruv. Like, she probably knows, but she don't know it's me, so it's fine. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's stuff, it's stuff in this. Right. Unbelievable. It's Unbelievable. Okay, so the question was, is anyone... Roderick Thomas with the $2 super chat, he says... She belongs to the streets. Yes, she does. Can I, know can, I see what he, can I see what he looks like? Yes. I just want to see how hot this man is. <laughs> No way this is an average looking I'll dude. I'll just show no. you. Just no, no, I won't, I won't show the, I won't show yeah. the, uh, yeah, don't show just the audience. I won't, I won't, I won't show the audience. Yeah. I just want to see. I'm going to okay. rate him one to ten. Has anybody, has anybody else been a simp? Me, I, I have. No. Male, male or female. Don't like. By the way, there's not, there, there's no such thing as a female simp. There's no such thing as a female simp. Because what women offer, what women offer to men doesn't really cost them anything. Uh, I'm a simp because I fuck him all the time and he doesn't do anything for me. Sweetheart, you've given your pussy away to countless men. Your vagina is not nearly as valuable as what it used to be. There's no such thing as a female simp. Women don't, women typically don't have the kind of resources to simp for men. Guys, we, we all know we've been a simp at some point. Uh, Mac with the $2 super chat says, how do I become a member? Uh, Devin, if you would, put the link to become a member in the chat, if you would. Oh, there you go. Appreciate that. Thank you, Mac. A simp. Well, what do you what do you, what do you, what do you define as a simp? I I I heard that a simp is like. Okay, well, so a simp, right? Yeah. Is say? someone who caters to anything and everything a woman wants and actually showers her with love and attention and doesn't necessarily get it back. That makes sense, but again, if we condense it. It's giving an undeserving woman access to your time, energy, attention, and resources. That's really what it is. Sarah's right. My definition is just a little bit more, you know, a little bit more brevity there. Mm. So, like, That's craving their simp. attention. That's a, a, you shower her with everything, and you love her, and you want her, and you show all this kind of stuff. But she's kind of like, eh. So you kind of simp. What about... Okay. So you've never, you never you telling me you've never been a simp for a woman. Dude, the girl on the left is bad. She's I've hot. never been a simp, but uh I can uh, I can tell that I've been always someone who's who's really caring and someone who's as a man, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If I think if you if you Shout out to Jonathan Gale, <laughs> newest member of Chat Monko, Privileges. Monko, Monko. At Jonathan Gale to welcome him to the TSR family. Jonathan, if you would put your age and location in the chat. I appreciate I appreciate that very much. I got to tell you, man, I like my man's glasses here. I like my man's glasses. My man's glasses are off the charts. <laughs> Those are cool as shit. 
Ha ha, got you, 60, uh, 56. Welcome to Tap Privileges. Dom DeMarco. Marco. At Ha ha, got you, 56, to welcome him to Chat Privileges. I appreciate that very much. If you would, ha ha, got you, 56, put your age and location in the chat. Age and location in the chat. Let's continue. You, if you were raised in the right household and you see your parents or your father or your mm -hmm. uncle taking yep. care of their wives yep and uh, they raise you to be to, they raise you to grow up to become a gentleman mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. ah there we go they raise you to become a gentleman but here's what here's what fathers aren't teaching their sons they're teaching them how to be a gentleman but they're not teaching them to be a gentleman discriminately I am not about to be a gentleman to a woman who is not a lady. Sorry. I'm not about to be a gentleman to a woman who is not a lady. Shout out to Massachusetts and uh, the Washington, D.C. area. Thank you, fellas. I think there's, okay, let's just, like, okay, I'm going to step back and explain to you. Okay, let's just say at school, yeah, you have this, this kid, a very smart kid, you know, but... People don't call smart kids smart kids. They call them weirdos or yeah, like something else, different names. Yep. Because they're smart. Mm -hmm. Right. Right. So uh, what I don't understand is what if a man is just a gentleman, but end up by end up calling a sim, end, been, up, end up end up okay, being called so a sim. Yeah, that one, Carla says, father's not teaching how to vet women. That's exactly right. Have you ever, as a man, felt like you were given more to a woman? We always than absolutely she, than she was yep. to you. We absolutely. We, that's because men have more to offer women than women have to offer men. Men have men have much more to offer women than women have to offer men. At least in the beginning. The man to this day, we always give more than more than women give. That's how I feel. Okay. You know? Because as a man, as a provider, you know, I think But you're married though, aren't you? I am married. Okay, yeah, yeah. And uh This dude is married? I don't know. This dude looks. This dude's got. This dude's got. This dude's got player energy. <laughs> He's got player energy, man. A dude who looks like this with this kind of swag. <laughs> Maybe he's an expert cheater. And the reason why I say that is because women expect more from us than we do expect from them. Woo! Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. That's the problem. Wow, very well said. I'm going to tell you what, man. These British guys are really, they seem to be very smart over there across the pond. That's exactly right. Women expect far more from us than we do from them. That's what's wrong with today's modern men is that you're not requiring shit. She lets you fuck her a couple of times, ready to put a ring on it. Negative. No. It takes far more. It takes far more than sex to get access to my tears, my time, energy, attention, and resources. Sorry. Sorry. No, 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 no. It takes a lot more than that. This is what it takes to get access to my time, attention, energy, and resources. See the screen? See that screen? Number one, you have to make sure you become what I want you to be sexually. Real talk. Hoops, heels, and a smile. You have to iron my shirts and my clothes. You got to do my laundry. You need to cook for me. You need to serve me. And you need to do this consistently. Of course, I'll say it again. You need to become what I want you to be in the bedroom. You need to work out to make sure that you maintain that physique. I don't care who you are. You absolutely need to require all of this from your woman. You know, mm -hmm. women expect more from from men to do than we as a man expect women to to, right. to give us. Right. So uh, either way, whether you're a simple gentleman or a gangster. Hey, welcome to Crack Tap Privilege for Mac. Appreciate that, Mac. If you would welcome at Mac to welcome him to chat privileges, to welcome him to the TSR family. If you would, Mac, put your age and location in the chat. I'd greatly appreciate that. Let's continue. Whatever, whatever you call yourself, you still, as a man, give you more. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so, so, so why is it so? Why is the simp so narrowed down to mm-hmm. the gender though when mm-hmm. it comes to men? That is my big question. Because the hell kind of question is that? I don't, I don't know many female simps. To be fair, like I know men. That's because there's no such thing as a female simp. Like female simps don't exist. You want to know why female simps don't exist? You want to know why female simps don't exist? Because if they don't get anything in exchange for their vaginas, they don't really lose anything. Female simps don't exist because they're giving men something they've given every man. It's no, it's, dude, it's, it's nothing for them. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Those that like usually say they're simps, it's like all they offer is pussy. Oh, wow. There it is. There it is. That's it. Pearl just nailed him. Pearl just nailed him. You don't get that kind of content from Danica Marie, do y'all? Pearl just absolutely nailed it to the wall. All they offer is pussy. It's nothing for women to offer men pussy. They offer every man pussy. They're not out anything. Doesn't cost them anything. That's why, dude, that's why women give up the pussy so easily because they give it to everybody. No, ninety percent of girls. It's like, what else do you bring to? Do you know why? Ninety percent. Go ahead. No, 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 no. Do you know why? Because girls. Oh, here we go. Here we. Here we go. Socially accepted to be simps because you're a girl. So when a girl does too much, what do you mean? What do you mean? That means. So right. So say if a guy likes me. And he's going over the top. I'm airing him. He's still messaging me. I don't give him attention. He's buying me stuff. Mm -hmm. You're now a simp. It's embarrassing. Right. Now, say if a guy don't text me back, I still message him. A guy don't message me back, I'm still doing stuff for him. You're a girl. So it's a bit more... In society, people are going to judge a girl less for being a simp than a boy. No, but... uh, I understand what she means, though. There's no such thing as a female simp, guys. Like, females don't simp, dude. They don't. <laughs> they can't. There's nothing a female can do that's simpish. I understand what she means. Girls are just expected no, it's true, cause to kind of not- chase after boys. But yeah. boys are not expected to chase okay, after but girls as a, in the but same as a, way. But as a woman, what would you prefer? Would you prefer? Ah, I want guys you- to chase me. Okay, so hang on. Okay, that's a very interesting um, thing. You want guys to so chase me? They do. To a certain extent. Right, uh, this is where I'm going to go. So if you want a guy to chase you, yeah? If a guy's constantly chasing you and showing mm-hmm. that he's always that. about you, blah, 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 blah. Guess what? You're going to get I bored of that. There right? it is. The guy I- there it is. Sarah just nailed it. I want a guy to chase me. No, you don't. <laughs> the only reason why you want men to chase you is because the men you want don't. And how does this woman wipe her ass with those fingernails? Can anybody tell me how women wipe their ass with these fingernails? How does she wipe her ass, guys? Does she just not shit? Uh, Roderick Thomas with the $5 Super Chat. Appreciate that very much. Says, Sir Donovan, how uh, would you make merch labeled Save Your Tears? I would wear that everywhere. Stays, Donovan, stay sharp. Thank you for the great content, sir. Absolutely appreciate that. It's actually a good idea. Devin, write that down. Write that down. Right now, I actually have my, uh, I've actually got my hamster out and about. Uh, my hamster, uh, Penelope, I got her a little hamster ball in a track, and she's racing around the track. Give her a little bit of off time here. I used to chat to you. I would probably see him two, three times a week, and he'd probably ring me every day. Mm-hmm. But when I ring him, he don't ring back. And that's why you like him. But you like, but look at that. Look at that. Look, 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 look. Look at the twinkle in her eye. When I ring him, he doesn't ring back. Watch. Watch. Mm-hmm. But when I ring him, he don't ring back. Watch. Look. Look. But when I ring him, he don't ring back. Look how positively. Look how positively excited she is. Look at that twinkle in her eye. She looks like she's turned on. She looks like she is turned on. <laughs> but you like, but you like that though. Yes, she does. But if he rings me, let me. I, oh, no, I'm no, I'm not gonna say. But you like that though, right? Yes, you do. Like, no, like but like, I miss but, you. But like, but like, but like, but you uh-huh. like that. Uh-huh. But but uh-huh. like, if he rings me and I don't call back, there's an issue. <laughs> no, but it's... yes, there is. <laughs> there is an issue because he's got you trained. <laughs> the thing is, uh, women like that chase. 
Mm. They like guys to chase, like the chase but, more. No, no, but hang on. No, 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 no. Guys, we like the chase, but the reason why? Well, let me let him if explain. If a guy is chasing you down too much, it's, no, exactly. Don't do that. There it is. Yeah, too much no, time. No, no, do you know what it is? <laughs> it depends. It depends how I'm responding. If I'm actively responding to you in a way that suggests you can still chat to me, cool. If I'm airing out your thing, stop what you're doing mm -hmm. immediately. Stop this. what you're doing. <laughs> And where is that man now? You see that? Oh, and she has a tongue bar? Oh, dude, this bitch is a super She belongs hoe. to the streets. This bitch is a super hoe. God damn. The level up, man. Welcome to chat privileges. At the level up, man, to welcome him to chat privileges, if you would. Level up, man. Put your age and location in the chat. Let's continue. If I, if I air you... It's not, if I air you two, one too many times, it's a actually just stop chatting to guys, me. Why don't you just say you're not interested? Yes, yes. thank you. Why? Because thank you. Thank you. One at a time, one at a time. Why one at a time? Let me just say to the camera, this is why nice guys finish love. Bingo! <laughs> there it is. You, you cannot do that. Yo, Sarah Garvey's got fucking game. This dude knows exactly what the fuck is going on. I like this. Look at him. <laughs> no. Wow. Let me, let, let she me needs to explain you. to you why okay. that you cannot do that. Let me because explain why. Aggression let me comes explain why. Next. Let oh. me explain why, right? Oh, because here we why go. you just cut off the guy that's chasing you, but you don't really want the attention? Because I promise you, the guy that I want is not giving me enough attention that I don't need yours. Your attention is feeding my ego. However, there it is. When my man replies, yeah, go away. Okay, so so let me <laughs> just. So you're gonna use. See that? She literally just verified what we all teach here. The guys they like, the guys they like, they chase. The guys they don't, they just use guys to just blow up their ego. They'll respond to the guys that blow up their ego, but as soon as the guy she really wants responds, now she doesn't. She wants nothing to do with you. She wants nothing to do with you. Use the other guys for attention, and Listen. then and then chase after the guy you don't, like. See? How would you feel if you this, were in their shoes? I'm a hypocrite. No, no, but I'm, I'm hip, saying because you started, that you started, you started the podcast saying that men ain't shit, but you you kind of are being ain't shit to men. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. I'm so, a hypocrite. <laughs> do you know what it is? I hey, at least she kept it real. At least like, you own it. I feel like if I'm, in, I feel <laughs> like if I'm intentionally <laughs> airing your message. See, here's the thing: all girls are hypocrites in this way. Not all girls. Most modern women are just like this. Most modern women are just like this. Since I'm not responding to you, you know what it is. Mm -hmm. That's right. If a guy is airing my messages and I choose to double or triple message him, I know what it is. Mm -hmm. And I'm choosing to be that person. Mm -hmm. If you're messaging me and I air you, you message me again and I air you, you message me again and I air you, but I enjoy the attention you do give me when yep. you're messaging yep. me, picking me up. Look at this. I'm choosing to air you, you know what it is. This is there why it is. This is why yeah. There it is. is. Dude, hey, I got to give it to her. I got to give it to her. I got to give it to her. At least she's being honest. She's letting y'all know exactly what it is. She's letting you know. She's letting you know. If I'm double, triple texting a man, yeah, I already know what it is. But if you're double and triple and texting me and I'm not texting back, you know what it is. Dude, hey, man. Hang on. This is why I tell men. Just focus on yourself. That's right. Guys, That's right. focus, guys, focus that on yourself money. because you will never, ever, ever, ever be able to understand the psychology of a woman no because for <laughs> as a guy right this is awesome does that make sense to us yeah, it, no. does. it does does that make sense like, but, no. but, but, because as a man if we say we want x y and z that means we want x y and z right and we go for it uh, yeah i mean and a woman will say they want x y and z but if you give them x y and z they're like, no. Uh, I don't know if I want that. Yeah, it's right. Like, but you right, said right, you right. wanted it. I can't like that's not me. Uh Roderick Thomas says uh what is air you? What that means is ignore you. If I ignore you, that's what that's what that means. Shout out to DeRay Davis. Welcome to Chat Privileges. Dom DeMarco. At DeRay Davis to welcome him to the TSR family. DeRay, if you would, put your age and location in the chat. The level up, man. 37 in New Orleans. Uh, shout out. Shout out to the Bayou. That is one city I've never been to. I would love, I would love, I would love to go to New Orleans. I would love to visit New Orleans one day. If I ever, dude, if, if Devin and I always say, if we ever visit New Orleans, we're going to have to fast for like three days. Because, dude, I will eat my weight in food down there. New Orleans is a fantastic food city, so I'm told. Yes, Team Peterson, a better a better description. Leave you unread means air you. Yep, that's it.
No, personally. For if real. you give me exactly what I want, well, I want we're good. you're my man now. We're good. Mm. You're my man. We're good. That's it. You're my man, personally. You're my I'm man. D- you see the guy that's but giving no, me the no, attention wait, I didn't yeah. ask for. But wait, but why are you chasing the one guy who's not giving you what you no, want? No, no, no. I don't. You're chase- that's exactly why she's chasing him, Pearl. Is because they're not giving her exactly what she wants. Chasing a he man that's not me. your man. He chases me, and no. I let him stay there. Stop the cap. No, you don't. Because if he chased you, then you wouldn't have anything to do with him. You see, so she keeps it real until the the the, the rubber meets the road. Every time I look at uh, old girl in the gray on the left, like both of these girls keep giving us the fuck me eyes. Like they're very, very cognizant of the camera. No, hang on. You're actually with a man that's not your man. Do you understand that? That's right. You just said earlier you were a side chick. No, not anymore. But you were a side chick. You but used to be not the cat. You know She's cat. Do you know what? I didn't go in saying I want to be next. If I knew from Bro, the beginning, sir, I'd rather I'd rather be. No, no, no. This bitch has a tattoo on her face. Holy shit! This bitch belongs to dude. Woo. I'd rather be. Let me land. I'd rather be single, yeah, than than knowing that I'm a friend with Let me land. with benefit, yeah. Right. Or, or I'm banging this girl who has a who has a boyfriend already. Right. I don't want that. Let yeah. me yeah. land. As a man, no. As a man, we don't do that. Like, no, we, don't, no, we, don't no, bang, we don't bang. We don't bang. We don't bang girls that have boyfriend already. Let me land. But she wants women, to finish. It's fine oh, for them. Oh, you can't talk for every man. No. Hang on. Let, let, let me speak. Let me speak. Let me speak. Go on. Go on. No, no. Finish. Finish, bro. Finish. Finish. finish, finish. But, but for, for, for girls, it's fine for them to know damn well in their head that this guy that they're sleeping with mm-hmm. are not their man. Right. Yep. But you wouldn't do that. Listen, if uh, as men we know, if I will, if a woman that we're sleeping with, yeah, is getting penis from somewhere else. <laughs> no, 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 we, no, we don't want that. We don't want nope. that. No, we don't. No, we don't. Sometimes, sometimes sex is just sex. Don't get me wrong. I felt. Uh oh. Sometimes sex is just sex. Sometimes sex is just sex. This woman has fucked so many guys that she can compartmentalize. She can compartmentalize sex from feelings. It's, it's, it's possible for women to do this, but it takes them a damn long time to do it. And if a woman actually achieves this, she belongs to the streets. Women should not, d- dude, when a woman has so much sex, when a woman has so much, when a woman is able to compartmentalize sex from feelings when she is able to delineate then you know she's had way too much dick in her life way too any woman who is able to emotionally compartmentalize sex is a woman who has been ran through plain and simple that's another slut tell i feel like there's always an end goal to end up with someone but sometimes you know in the time there's someone you're mad sexually attracted to and they can stay around until you find whatever you need to find. Find whatever you need to find. There it is. Fuck the men you want till you find the men you need. Guys, this woman has given us the game. She's given up the game, dude. She's letting you guys know. She's letting you guys know how to treat women like her. Guys, catch and release. Catch and release. Women like this are not fit. Women women like this are not fit for relationships of any sort. Not even situationships. Women like this just need to be butt fucked and discarded. That's it. They need to be butt fucked and discarded. That's it. That's all there is to it, man. That is all there is to it. Uh, Devin, put this on the poll. Put this on the poll. What is this girl's body count? And we all know who we're talking about. What is what? What is the side chick's body count? What is the side chick's body count? Is it over fifty or under fifty? Is it over 50 or under or under 50? What is the side chick with the Von Dutch hat, the face tattoo, the Botox, and the hand tattoo? What is her body count? What is her body count? Is it over 50? Is it under 50? Over 50 or yes? How many guys has she fucked? Over 50, under 50, or yes? Or I added that last part. Sorry about that, Dev. Over 50 or under 50? Just keep it like that. Uh, Beauty All Around says she is letting everyone know that she is a red flag. Look at her. She even dyed her hair red to let everyone know. (laughs) Okay. All right. Okay. (laughs) Don't get me wrong. If I met the guy and you had a girlfriend from the jump, I wouldn't have entertained it. Stop the cap. That's bullshit. Women entertain men with girlfriends all the time. 
all the time. Kyle2020 says, Man Talk had a video of a chick saying hers is in the thousands. Oh, my God. That is, to me, that's disgusting. That is disgusting, dude. Sounds like a little bit but of you did, to you, me. You know what you did from the job? I mean, come on. The first I didn't month, know he had to go for the first month, two first weeks. month that's two the weeks. job. After no, the but, no, but I, mean, I have a serious question, though. So have you ever asked him, like, what his girlfriend has that you don't? No, no, no. I, because, like, no, 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 I'm just thinking, like, I, if I, I was going to... I can tell you what his girlfriend has. It, it's, it's not... It's not what does she have that I don't. It's not what does she have that I don't. No, it's what she has that his girlfriend doesn't. Guys, what she has that his girlfriend doesn't. I can promise you this. His girlfriend does not have a tongue bar. She does not have a face tattoo. She doesn't have those cat she doesn't have those long fingernails and she doesn't have any and she doesn't have hand tattoos. That's what she doesn't have. That's what she doesn't have. Uh, DL Saint, I really want to know podcast with the fifty dollars super chat. Dom DeMarco says I reacted to your Kevin Samuels fresh and fit video. Just wanted to pay tribute. Appreciate that. Salute to you for keeping it real, brother. Leading from the front. Thank you very much. I appreciate that very very much. Let's continue. Yeah, if I, I couldn't was, take no, no, no. it. If I was gonna be a side chick, shit, I'd compete. If you're gonna no, do but, it anyway. No, no, no. If you're gonna do it anyway. <laughs> do you know what it is? Like, <laughs> I felt like she's lame. Uh, she's good. Like she's good looking, right? Oh yeah. All right. So, <laughs> yeah. oh my god. All right. Oh my god. So hang on. You guys let me, can have let those, me let me ask, uh, let me ask a question with that then. Yeah. Uh, Devin, if you would bring me a bottle of water, please. Devin, if you would bring me a bottle of water. If if he um broke up with his girlfriend. Impossible. Not no, with me. No, I'm saying if he broke up with his girlfriend and said I would just want to be impossible. With you, why why is that impossible? Look at he her. cheated with me. No, but I'm saying I if don't he, trust him. No, but. No. And that's exactly why she wants him. Guys, are you listening to what this woman is saying? Are you listening to what this woman is saying? She can't even wrap her mind around the possibility of this guy breaking up with his girlfriend. Why? Because that automatically makes him unattractive. You, listen to what she just said. Listen to what she just said. She's like, it's impossible. There's no way. No. Because if this man, oh, thank you, appreciate that. Because if this man leaves his relationship to start a relationship with her, she now he now has less value in her eyes. Guys, this is how modern women are. The more you care about them, the less they care about you. But the worse you treat them, the better they treat you. Guys, this woman is literally telling the world. Do not treat me like a lady. If you do, I will lose respect and attraction for you. That's why she can't even fathom the idea that the man she is sleeping with would break up with his girlfriend. This is how fucked up modern women are, guys. This is how fucked up they are. This woman is so far gone, she cannot imagine her life. She cannot imagine her life as the main chick. She she can't even think. She's like, no, no, no. I don't want to hear it. Unbelievable. No, but if he said, I'm going to break up with my girlfriend and I'm going to be with you, just In, you and impossible. me. Impossible. Would See? you be with him? Impossible. Why? Is so that why a no? Is that a no? That's, you wouldn't be with him. Listen. Karma, why are you with him? Listen. Me because again. you said you love this guy. Unbelievable. So you would be with him, right? Listen, Unbelievable. Am I a bit of an idiot for this guy? Absolutely. Un However... I'm a chosen idiot, as in I choose to be there. You're a chosen this idiot. This is in like the insanity. Guys, 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 guys. This woman is literally telling us. This woman is literally telling us she does not want to be the main chick. She's doing the mental gymnastics to justify her main chick mentality. And the girls up here at the front, they know what's happening. They know what's happening. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Main chick is worse than the side chick. Do you know what? Oh, my God. Yo. Oh, my God. I can't believe what I'm hearing. I did not expect to hear this level of game. So you would be with him, right? Listen, am I a bit of an idiot for this guy? Mm -mm -mm. Absolutely. However, I'm a chosen idiot, as in I choose to be there. You're a chosen idiot. I feel like the main chick is worse than the side chick. She says, I feel like the main chick is worse than the side chick. What? The main chick is worse than the side chick. Guys, this is modern women. This is modern women. And, dude, it's funny because on Pearl's show, they, dude, the women on Pearl's show, they are much more forthright. 
Like, they're not making any bones. They're like, hey, I'm a chosen idiot. I'm a chosen idiot. This woman just sat here and told us, hey, man, if the, if, 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 if the guy I like likes me, I'm not going to like him as much. I can't date a man who doesn't have a girlfriend. I have to be the, I've got to be the side chick, not the main chick. What? Wow. What the French toast? That's what I'm saying, Kevin. God damn. Shout out to DeRay Davis with the $20 super chat. Dom DeMarco, DeMarco. Appreciate that super chat, uh, DeRay. Thank you very much for that. Do you know why? Why? Because the side chick knows she's a side chick. She knows what her role is. She knows what I'm, the main chick is thinking. That's my man. Oh, that's I love him. Unbelievable. No, yeah, love but him. the but the main chick gets the commitment. Yes. Uh, that's what like, it, thank you. The main chick. The main chick. The main The main chick should be loved. How often? How often did I see my man? Yeah, but he ain't leaving her for you. Oh, there it is, baby girl. Baby girl in the gray says he ain't leaving her for you. Real shit. Still one at time, one at time, one at time, one at time. So what you say? I was saying he ain't leaving her for you. No, that's fine. So either way, she is the chosen one. Do you know what I mean? There's no chosen one in this situation. Because no, she was there. no, there is a chosen one in the situation. It's the main chick. You see, the main chick gets his time, attention, his time, his energy, and his, his attention and his resources. All the side chick gets is dick. That's it. This is unbelievable. This woman is sitting here rationalizing, trying to convince us that being the being the side chick is better than being the main chick. Unbelievable. This is this is insane. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. No, situation. No, everybody's no. a twin. You know what it is? There is no chosen one I because feel like. if you're the chosen one, I feel like. If you're the chosen one, you would be about you. Do you get it? Do you know what I feel 100%. like though? But if you're a side chick, she's a, she's a side chick as well because yeah. he has you're both side chicks. That's, that's, that's not true. That's not true. And now and now the two girls up front are now sitting here justifying being a side chick. Un <laughs> this is unbelievable. I can't believe what I'm seeing. These girls are just being honest. They're just like, hey, you know what? I'd rather be a side chick. Wow. Because he's not giving you all... lot, neither of you what you require in a relationship. Mm -hmm. He's just playing both of you. He's telling her you're my girl. He's telling you I like no. you. No, 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 of the situation she be getting dms from other girls so, so she semi knows however i feel like there's a difference between say if i'm with a man yeah the guy she's the, the, the guy she's simping for that's a high value man that's a high value guy and the reason why we know this is a high value man is because it appears his main chick knows he's got side bitches that's i'm with drake and then all of a sudden... Drake's not with you. <laughs> no, he is not with you. No, no yeah, let's yeah, yeah. say let, let's, I'm let's, officially let's with not, Drake. Let's not get yeah, carried away. And then you. all of a sudden, someone richer and more power comes along. Am I necessarily going to leave Drake just because something better is coming? Because so we what for already love have... You're assuming that that guy who is more rich and more powerful than Drake, powerful than Drake, also wants you. That's the problem with modern women. They think... That just because they're fucking a high value guy means that high value men are also going to want to commit. Nope. Not a chance. Not a chance. DJ Berserk with a $5 super chat says, if you ever come to NOLA, I'd have to shake your hand. I'm behind in time. Absolutely, man. Absolutely. God, I would love to. Dude, I really would love to visit New Orleans. I really would. Money, I'm no, but you get what I'm saying. But you get what I'm saying. Can I see this girlfriend? Look? Can I see if, this girlfriend looks like? Okay, so I, I don't have a picture. I want to know who this dude is. Like now, they got me curious. Actually, one, you know one, what the difference one, is. One like? second, one second, one second. That actually leads me to something that I actually was going to ask. Um, who's? Do you know what monkey branching is? Oh, I never heard of that term. Okay, so monkey branching is when you're in a relationship, right? Mm-hmm. But you kind of. You've got a there's a branch somewhere else that you might you, hang mean, on though. you might go somewhere else. You're in a relationship, but you you're thinking mm, over there. So when you said that you were you're with Drake, etc., but there's a man, or if someone more rich and more successful comes oh. along, would you go? I think, and correct me if I'm wrong, ladies. I think women monkey branch 
No. More no, so no, no, than no. men do. No. Oh, my. Oh, men no, no. do it in the dark. No, no, oh, they... oh, this is so funny. Oh, yes. Oh, look. Look at all of them. No, 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 no. Yeah. Do you know why? No. Do you know why? Man. Oh. oh, no. Yeah, guys, what you just saw is the perfect example. What you just saw is the perfect example of the men of men versus women. <clears throat> you ask any woman who cheats more, men or women, they all say men. Who monkey branches more, men or women? They all say men. The reason why they think that men monkey branch more than women is because they're only thinking of the top 10% of guys. The example she used was Drake. I say this all the time. Dude, most men are sexually invisible to most women. Most men are sexually invisible to most women, guys. So when Sara asks them questions like, well, who monkey branches more? Men or women, they're, oh, men, men monkey branch more. Yes, the top 10% of men monkey branch more. The bottom 90% of men, they're just happy to have a relationship. And here's another thing. Men don't leave relationships. Women do. This is with high-value men or otherwise. Women end 99.9% .9 of relationships, legally or otherwise. Uh, Kenny Lester with the $10 Super Chat. Appreciate that very much says they know they are nowhere near main chick material for a powerful dude. And when it comes to walking the aisle, you'd be surprised how few would be willing. The best side spot is the life they choose. You know what? There, I think that I think there's something to what Kenny Lester just said. I think there is something to, to, to what Kenny just said. These bitches, dude, all of these bitches know that they're not white material. They know that they're, that, that, that they are not white material. They know they're not white material. They know that there is, they're, they're, look, no. That's why this woman is satisfied with being a side chick, because she knows she's not a main chick. And Pearl asked her, do you ever ask your man, what does she have that I don't know? She doesn't ask that because she knows what the main chick has that she doesn't. Do you know, say if I've got something good, stable, good money, treats me good, da 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 da, da. Now, I meet someone, I think the connection's better, or the money's better, whatever, something's better. Do you see this? She just described a solid relationship. Good looking guy, treats me well, has money. And she still entertains thoughts of someone better. Unbelievable. But if I leave what I've got, that might collapse and I've got nothing. I tell you why, because you know what hypergamy is, right? Yeah. So hypergamy, hypergamy is that women want to date, are constantly trying to date up. Yes. No, no, no. Co yeah. hang, wait, 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 wait. Women are constantly trying to of date. Of course they are. They're trying to, they're getting, trying and to the get... girl's like, no, 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 no. This woman just used three examples. If I'm in a relationship and someone better comes along, that's what this is. The best deal that they can get. Men sure. men will get a deal and be like, you know what? I'm, I'm good. quite happy with this. I'm good. And, and hang on, wait, let, let me finish. Men will get a deal. They will get a woman who's a six out of ten. That's right. That she ticks all the boxes. Boom! Coast for the rest of their life, dude. Right. This guy, I swear to God, this guy Sara is fucking spitting game, dude. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> so women are always looking for that level up. That's right, right. 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 Which is why, which is why, if I was to ask all of you women here right now, the types of men that you want, you would probably list a man in the top twenty percent of men, mm -mm. right? Mm -mm. But there if it you're is. listing a man that's in the top twenty percent of men. What's going to happen is, what if a man comes up who's in the top 15%? Uh -huh. What if a man that comes uh -huh. up who's in the top 10%? Uh -huh. but they're going to jet because women are always looking to upgrade. They're always looking to upgrade. I'd be, be dating by me. No, no, no. But listen, what what you, no, 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 you just, you just, you, you just nah. show me, you just show me his picture. You just not show him me his picture. I, I, That's top, he's top 20% of men. Yeah. We don't have the same type. It, oh, but, we don't have the same type, bitch, please. Oh, get out of here. Stop the cat. All women have the same fucking type. Get out of here. It does not go down to, like, back, for example, there's just a traditional way of a man needing to provide for a woman. And do you know what I'm saying? Our positions in life, even to do with tradition and culture, does that not, where it falls to you when you, nah. exactly. I'm, no, I mean, because it, when he's talking about women trying to get the highest, highest, no, well, the I, highest I caliber she's a great and trying, of to, it and trying yeah. to go, like, from hair to hair, career wise, money wise, yeah. home, family. For example, so exactly that's what you boys. I'll, do. I'll, I'll tell you why. You, you take Kim Kardashian for for an example. Uh huh. Right? Mm -hmm. Here Kim we go. Kim Kardashian started out with Ray J. Yep. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Then Reggie she went Bush. To Reggie Miller. That's Reggie mm -hmm. Bush. Was NFL football. Oh, okay. So he's British. He doesn't know, but at least he knows. Not Reggie. It's not Reggie Miller. It's Reggie Bush. This guy knows his shit. Player, right. Yep. And then there was an. I think there was another NFL football yeah, player that yeah. she yeah, went yeah, with. Yeah, right. Yeah. Yep. And then she found Kanye. Yeah. But, yep. but hang on. But Kanye. 
was the pinnacle of Kim Kardashian's. There it is. Um, ma the man that she could find. There right? it is. So what she Only done? So no, what she done? I don't think she, so. Hang on, but what she done? She started to breed with. Because in her, in her heart and her mind. That's interesting. Con and, and, and listen, Sarah is speaking facts. Kim K fucked Ray. Dude, Kim K, let's just, let, let, let's just look this up. Kim Kardashian dating history. Because what he is talking about is facts. Kim Kardashian has dated many, many, many men. But she had, but she chose to have children with just one. The billionaire. She chose to have children with the billionaire, right? So there was Damon Thomas, right? See this? Damon Thomas was a somebody. Ray J, a little more value. That, that's, where the, that's where the sex tape came from. Then she was with Nick Cannon, a little more value. Then Reggie Bush, a little more value, Right? Every dude, every man, Kim K. Uh, yep, the Chris Humphreys, little more value than Kanye West. That's the pinnacle. That's the pinnacle. She dated all these high value guys, guys. She's dated them all. She's dated them all. But ever since, ever since Kanye, the billionaire, crazy, but billionaire. Then there was Van Jones. Van Jones is just a political pundit and a race baiter. Pete Davidson, <laughs> a far cry from Kanye. Guys, this is hypergamy. This is hypergamy. Kim Kardashian has dated many high-value guys. She chose to have offspring with Kanye West, whose net worth is north of a billion dollars. Guys, this is not an accident. This is how modern women are. It does not matter. It does not matter their race doesn't matter their socioeconomic status. This is what we mean, gentlemen, when we say all women are like that. When we say all women are like that, we're not saying all women are the same. No, women, women are very different on a surface level. They come in many shapes, sizes, personality traits, et cetera, et cetera. But fundamentally, fundamentally, they are all the same, meaning... Meaning that their objective, their objective is to date or consolidate on the highest value man available to them. It does not matter. Kim Kardashian is a millionaire, blah, 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 blah. Kim Kardashian operates the same way fundamentally as Kim Smith. That's how it goes, guys. This is the way women operate. They're always looking for a better deal. Always. Hypergamy is universal in every woman. It doesn't matter the culture. It doesn't matter the national. It doesn't matter. It does not matter. Jay Blaze with the comment of the day says, once you figure out women, they're so simple. That's exactly right. Damian Orozco with the $2 super chat says, yeah, Chris Humphreys too, former NBA player. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Kim Kardashian fundamentally is just like every is just like every woman, modern or not. Modern or not. Women who are dude, women who have never seen the internet, tribes in Africa, obscure countries, they're hypergamous. This is in their this is this is how they're programmed. This is how they're programmed. All of them. This is what we mean when we say all women are like that. That's what we mean. This doesn't mean all women are the same. But but all women, all women act the same in relationships with regards to their to their mating strategies. Devin just nailed it. It is a survival mechanism. That's what it is, guys. Nothing more. And don't take it personally. This is just how women are. Women are the weaker, smaller sex. Yeah, they need to date up. They need to marry up. They need to fuck up. That's how they are. Women are not designed to commit to inferior men. That's never the way it's been. This is why this is why unconditional love does not exist. Never has, nope. never will. Let's continue. Mind. She was like, this is top this is top level. Mm -hmm. So she's she's now got four children for Kanye. Right? Then, See that? Wait, 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 wait. Let's wait, wait. Yeah. She's got four children for Kanye. Yep. Right? She felt like she found the pinnacle. He's a billionaire. 
There she's it is. A multi millionaire. There it is. She felt like that was her level. That's mm-hmm. it. After that, she divorced Kanye. Where's she gone to? There it you is. You know what? That's true. Pete Davidson. Yeah, yeah. right. right. And do you know why? Thank you. Because after having four children, she already hit the peak. She, she hit, hit her peak. True. She hit the right? peak. So yeah. after. So after and and dude, men who have more value than Kanye are few and far between. Number one, number two, they don't want. They don't want a forty-three-year-old single mother of four. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care how fat her ass is. I don't care how good he looks. Giselle Bunchen is going to be in that same situation. Yeah, she's fucking her Brazilian jiu-jitsu teacher. That's all fun and games, guys. That's all fun and games. Women always win initially. They always win initially in the event of a divorce or the breakup. At least it seems like they do. They always win initially. They're getting all this attention. They're getting they're getting all this dick, right? Same with Giselle. She's getting all the attention and all the dick. Tom Brady's losing weight, losing football games. But in the end, Tom Terrific is going to win. Giselle is going to end up the miserable one. She fucked up. And no other man is going to put a baby in Giselle. Nope. She's already had two children with an apex alpha male, the greatest quarterback who ever lived, Tom Brady. And that wasn't enough for her. I hope she, dude, and you want to know the thing, you want to know what the, you, you want to know how this worked? You want to know what the, the, the sad thing is? Giselle will not figure this out until it's too late. She won't. She won't. So uh, Jay Blaze says this is uh, two dollars super chat says this is how the best genes are passed down. That's right. After uh, mm-hmm. Kanye West, from here on out, it's it's downhill for Kim Kardashian because she's That's got right. four you know children. Well, there it is. And, and let's not let's not let's yeah. not let's it's not let's not let's not, no, let's, let's, not, let's, let's, not let's not cap though as girls like how of course you want to repro- of course you, wait of course you want to reproduce with the best guy you can. There you go. Yes, thank you. To be fair, the way I see it is that. As girls, we always look for the best because... It's a survival mechanism, sweetie. Nothing more. Nothing more. I don't know why women have a problem with admitting their own nature. I don't know why women have a problem with admitting their own nature. I, if, dude, we as men, we admit our nature. You listen, we want the youngest, hottest, tightest girls out there. That's what... that That's... that's we Listen, we admit to that. Women are like, well, no, it's not always like that. Yeah, actually, it kind of is. We want, like, we don't, I don't know, I'm speaking from personal experience anyways. And if I meet a guy that's got everything I want, I'm not cheating on him. I'm not looking at other guys. I'm not. Stop the cap. I mean. But if you see, if you're dating someone and you see, like, things that are missing in that person, mm-hmm. automatically, your eyes going to wonder, guys, they can have a 10-10 girl, mm-hmm, everything mm-hmm. laid out mm-hmm. for them, whatever, mm-hmm. and they'll still cheat. I have, I have that's you know? Well, that's the difference. That's the difference. Just because a man cheats on you does not mean he does not love you. I say this all the time, guys. Sex is just an act for us. It's just an act. Guys, I love Devin to the moon and back. If I stick my dick in another if I stick my dick in another chick, it absolutely has no bearings on my feelings for her. Here's another tattoo. I'm gonna tell you what, man. I'm gonna tell you what, dude. I'm gonna tell you what. Um, I think that there are more women with tattoos than women without tattoos. I think more women have tattoos than women that don't. Kyle 2020 says, Myron and Fresh said it best. Everything about women is optimized for secrecy. Absolutely. I have a question for you. Would you rather have a guy that had everything you wanted, but he cheated from time to time, but you were the main chick, mm. or... A guy, let's say, Here let's say you're five deal breakers. He has three. Three of the five. Let's say you have five things you want. Yeah. He has three. <coughs> um, I'm not going to lie. As a, but he doesn't cheat. I'm taking see, the I cheat. Lie. I'm taking the, the cheat I'm, off. Because there it is. There it is. I'm not going to lie. I'm taking the cheater. There you go. That's the correct answer. Ladies, this doesn't make you bad people. This doesn't make you bad people. Staying with a man... Staying with a man who is sexually unfaithful because he provides you with the best life does not make you a gold digger. It makes you a woman. It makes you a woman. And now she's going to try now she's going to sit here and try to justify, I got to be honest, I'll take the cheater because you don't have to explain it. We know why you take the cheater. It doesn't make you a bad person. 
it does not make you it does not make women bad people to stay with a man who is sexually unfaithful. It doesn't. It makes you smart, <laughs> actually. Because men who can cheat generally bring more value to the world than men who cannot. And women inherently know and understand this. Let me tell I'll you one thing, Gab. Yeah. That's very in, that, that is very, no, that's no, very that's, honest. That's, that's, that's honest. Very honest. Most girls would. Most girls would. Yeah. Most, yeah, girls, yeah. Would. yeah only- most girls would, but most girls would not admit it. Most girls would rather have the cheater, but most girls would not admit that. Me, because I can't give that guy that has those mm-hmm. what, like, what I would give to the, someone who has everything I need. Type of thing. Would you kind of look the other way and be like, oh, I didn't yep. see? Do you know what? Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> you know what it is? I wish it was that easy. <laughs> in, my, oh, in my head, I like to say it out loud. I would take the free, but. If he cheated subtly and didn't embarrass me yeah, publicly, yeah, yeah, exactly. there you go. I can't lie. Exactly. I'd probably let it run. There it is, guys. Down there the rock, it rock, is. Rock, rock, rock. There it is. There it is. Like, this is, dude, I'm going to tell you what. I'm going to tell you what. This is the first time I've ever broken, this is the first time I've ever done an extended reaction to a Pearl video. But just based on what I'm observing here, and I'm, I'm going to have to do more of these later on, but just based on what I'm observing here, it appears it appears that Pearl's guests are much more, they're much, they're, they're much more uh, comfortable with being truthful. They are much more, they are, they are, they are, they are much more comfortable with being truthful. And what, what Miss B- Lightning Bolt I tattoo, I guess we'll call her Harry Potter. What she just said is absolutely true. Guys, listen, man. If you're going to step out on your woman, just don't get caught. That's when you know a man loves you. If a man loves you, he won't cheat. Negative. If a man loves you, he won't let you find out he's smashing chicks on the side. Because if your woman, and here's the thing, if your woman finds out, If other people around your woman find out, she has to be seen doing something. This is why. This is why women always take, why does she keep taking it back? He's cheated on her so many times. It's because he found, she kept finding out about it. She keeps taking him back because she knows that's the best she can do. Again, men who, men who can cheat, men who can cheat bring much more value to the table than men who cannot. Women inherently know this. Women inherently know this. And dude, 11 out of 10 women in their mind say, you know what? If he steps out on me from time to time, just don't disrespect me. Don't disrespect me. Don't get caught. Don't let anybody see you. Don't knock the bitch up. Don't fuck her in our house. Don't bring home any diseases. And I'm good. And I'm good. I just don't want to know about it. Don't disrespect me. Don't let my friends or family find out. And I'll look the other way. The difference between these women and the women on Fresh and Fit is that these women are being honest about their intentions. The girls on Fresh and Fit, oh, no, I would never, da 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 Yeah, you would, and you do. You ask women all the time, would you ever take, would you, if a, if, would you ever take back a cheating, a cheating man? No, I never would. Then ask them, have you ever taken back a cheating man? It's fucking crickets because it's absolutely true. Uh, Devin in the chat. Devin in the chat says approximately 59% of women have at least one tattoo compared to 41% of men. Wow. Unbelievable, man. Unbelievable. As long as I don't find out about it. If there were no public embarrassment <laughs> there it is. and he cheated very subtly, Duh, there it is. Like, then I can't no, lie. You're already being side shit. Like, of course True. you would take but that. There, there you go. No, no, no. Do you know what it is? It's not a public thing. No, no, Me no, and my man is not a public thing. As a woman, we already go through menstrual cycle, going to work, having to look good. Duh, 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 duh. And it's not even just looking good. Oh, cry me a fucking river. For men, some people do that. Personally, I don't. I love fashion. I just love to feel good within myself. Mm. But being a woman is a lot. Yeah, Not I have really. to say. Like- oh, stop it. Being a woman is hard. Are you kidding me? Bitch, all you have to do is look good. Oh, it's so hard to look good. And being a woman, get out of here. Being a bitch is easy. Dude, <laughs> Western women live the best lives of any class of human ever. It has never been easier to be a woman. Fuck out of here. 
life is girl, easy. Life is easy. Life, is, no, life is easy when we're skin no, and teeth and looking no, pretty. Is, That's what life, I would say. A, life as is a pretty. young woman, as a young man, life is hard. No, no, thank you. Easy. Do you know what? Do you know much better? Do you know what? 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 Do you know how much better the world treats you guys because you're pretty? Oh no, young. There's always pretty advantages. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. Okay, so don't tell me that life is hard. Like fuck out of here. Oh, life is so hard. No, it's not. Give me a fucking break. Girl, like as long as you're pretty, that's all you need to do. Thank not you. As a, man, as a man, there it is. You can't not just be handsome. You just can't be handsome. As a man, you guys, need to say something. something. This is unbelievable. Like these women are dropping game. She just sat here and said, as a woman, all you need to, if you're pretty, that's all you need to be. As a man, if you look good, you need to be a lot more than that. Dude, I got to tell you. Look, listen, man. This woman belongs to the streets, and she's got tattoos and all, but real shit. Like, this bitch is dropping fucking game here, man. Wow. Dude, I'm going to tell you what. Just, just based on my observation, the girls in Great Britain are much more forthright about their sexual strategies. They are just keeping it honest. They're keeping it 100 Yes, like, one at a time. As, we as, can hear each other. We're speaking over each other. Let's oh. not let's not do that. As a man, if you're not successful, top tier, you need to be multiple things. Multiple. As a woman, if you're just pretty, that can just run. That can run. You no, don't need you don't need to be really. a woman not and really. successful. No, no, successful. Obviously, is, don't get me wrong. There's the always the a reason niche why I say that. The reason why you're actually correct is because a man that's got a man who is successful, right? A man who is a multi-millionaire mm -hmm. had to go through blood, sweat, and tears, and hard work. That's right. Consistently That's right. become a millionaire. There it is. You can be 22 and mm. pretty and an and Instagram model. There it is. And that man can go into your DMs and say, look, I'm in Dubai and I've got a yacht, right? Mm. There I'll it fly is. you over. There it is. And th he can have 12 women on his yacht, yeah. right, who are dancing and having a great time. Yeah. And those women are literally on, on benefits yep. in the UK. That's right? it. But yep. that benefits in the UK. Uh, what he's talking about is uh, that's the that's the uh, uh, United States equivalent of welfare. There you go. That man has had to toil and work. That's right. And blood, sweat, and tears. Men have to build value. Women simply have to preserve it. That's it. Oh, I've got to go to the gym and make sure my body is tight. Yeah, it would be nice. It would be really, really nice for men to only have to stay in shape to maintain our value. All women have to do is stay in shape. That's all they got to do these days. It is not hard for women to keep their value these days. No, it's not. RA12 Figures with the $10 Super Chat. Appreciate that. It says, the women on Pearl's show are more comfortable being honest because Pearl has average men in the room. These are not men worth lying for. Fresh and Fit only has high value men on their show. Men like you, women act differently. That is interesting. REI, man, that is very interesting. That is extru That is, you want to know something, man? That is, you know what, man? I think you might be right. I think, because Myron only brings on high-value guys. Dude, Sneeko, Mike Rashid, Brandon Carter. Um, dude, like, Myron doesn't have just average run-to-the-mill-ass niggas on his podcast. And so the women have to put on a good front so as to not scare away the high-value men or change their opinion of them. But if there's this average men in the room, men they don't give a fuck about, yeah, they're like, yeah, I don't give a fuck. Cheat on me. Just don't embarrass me. And I'm yours forever. Wow. Very, dude, I'm going to give you Don DeMarco. For, oop, I'm going to give you Don DeMarco for that, man. Don DeMarco. Wow. Very, very astute observation, my friend. Very good observation. Wow, I never even thought of that. Never even thought of that. That makes all the sense in the world. That makes all the sense in the world. Holy shit. Very good. And women, this is what I'm trying to say. Women, you, you don't understand. You live life on easy street, you know? Mm. You don't understand. Real talk. Live, like men, if you find a successful man, right? trust me, that man has had to go through the hell to become successful. Facts. You can You can actually be next to a successful man and not have done much. Okay, Facts. So, but, Facts. But there it is. is as a man, mm. as you or me, that that part of your time, it's not going to be forever. Exactly. There it we is. We settle, mate. Fair enough. We settle. Can I add yeah? something? And then, uh, like, from my own experience, yeah, I came to this country when I was younger, right? 
From I, where? From Senegal, West Africa. Senegal, right? Oh wow, Senegal. Uh, I've did I've did a lot of stuff, right? I've I've did crazy stuff. But when it was time for me to get married, mm-hmm. yeah, I went back home. Went to Senegal. I went back to Senegal. Yeah, I found the right woman for me because I knew what I saw. From what I saw in this country, there's no chance. For the women in this country. For the women in yep. this country, there yep. was no chance. So you chance. wouldn't marry a woman no, in this country. No. No. Oh wow. Oh, there's one percent chance. Right. Okay. Yeah? Because I'm not saying every woman that I meet mm-hmm. in the city mm-hmm. on, on Friday night or Saturday night mm-hmm. are all the same. Yeah, but you're going to places. No, no. no, no hang I, on, I, but, I, but, I, but I, hang on. Let him finish. Let him finish. Someone from Vegas just called me, and I have no idea who it is. Huh, okay. I guess I'll... Hopefully they'll leave a voicemail. We, man, we we look forward to that settlement, okay? And for us, a settlement is getting married, finding the right woman... And having yeah. children. And yeah. having children yeah. and yeah. settle, yeah. right? Yeah. For, for, for women, their, their beauty... The older you get, it yeah. it, it, it goes down. It goes down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And as it goes down, it's harder for you to settle. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. It's harder Thank you. For you to settle. It's time. F- see, 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 see uh, that one, Carlos says. I hate it when women either think there is only one, there is only boss babes or lazy bimbos. Literally, after baseline attraction, all they need to be is coachable and competent for almost any man. That's it, guys. That's it. Just be fit, feminine, and friendly. Take good care of me. Give me sex when I want it, how I want it. Keep my house clean. Keep my belly full. Keep my balls empty. And I'm good. And I'm good. That's how it should work. I'm a big time now. Yeah, yeah, but the thing is, but the thing is, no. at the peak time is when you should be trying to settle. Exactly. There it is. And that's but, the thing. Well, well, a lot there of women of this, they don't realize. They don't realize. They don't nope. Realize they want to do settle. party girl and yep. the they want to do city girl stuff. And then when they get to 30, <laughs> girl, it's like, oh, oh my God, a, a like, girl. what the hell am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this guy, Sarah's got all the game. I love it. No, no, too late now. Sorry, go on. Hang on. One second. I did want to ask you, bro. Um... Did you feel like you were simping for girls in London, which is why you had to go to Senegal? No, and your no, mm. no. The reason, the reason. The oh, reason look at that! Look at old girl it. in the middle. She's like, oh, you were simping for girls. You couldn't handle girls in England, so you went to Senegal. It's because, <laughs> it's because one, it's because one. I didn't, I, 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 I don't trust the girls I see here raising my kids. Real talk. Because Real talk. I have seen women. But that's sniffing like out, well. sniffing out, lines in front of their kids. Those are not only your kids; those yeah, are your that, kids that as yeah. well. Yeah. Anyway, oh, uh, here comes the sign language. Here comes the sign language. I've I've seen girls sniffing out line in front of their their kids. I yeah, but like that's not wait, wait, No, wait, no, wait, no you're sleeping he's, he's, with he's, these women. Though, yeah, is the he's question. correct. I feel but like it's a cultural difference. I don't think you can't find a wife in this country, but it. No, you can't. <laughs> you can't. It's about the odds. It's about the nature and nurture. See, if you're in this country, it's not about the nature and nurture. What the fuck are you talking about? No. No, man, Red here is keeping it real. She knows. Look, man, it's almost impossible to find a woman that is wife material in the West. She knows it because she's not wife material. It'll be at odds. You might have to go through 50 girls to find one that you could There it is. There it is. I feel like in your country, because the culture is different, you probably have to only go through five girls to that's find it yeah, but the thing that's is we're it. not talking about simping right yeah the thing is with the women in the western world they, and hang on and women in the western world they seem like they want guys to simp do you know oh, what? Hang on, wait wait they want guys to simp for them okay mm. so what happens is when a man simps for a woman right it puts him in the feminine and it puts a woman bingo in the masculine yeah and bingo. so what, what happens is is that the man starts to be a woman and the woman starts to be a man Woo! and so what happened wow unbelievable yep yep sarah's the man dude and and, and so uh, i'm just saying and so what happens is is that the the dynamics of the relationship get skewed and so women <laughs> while they may like because women generally like attention you're women you like attention yeah. right yeah. <clears throat> however too much attention from a simp you ain't gonna respect him. No, sir. Just, just, think, think, just, think, think, just, think, just think of the guys that you guys have liked. And here's the thing. If a high value guy shows a woman too much attention, she's thinking, why does he have all of this time to show me attention? 
See, women know deep down, modern women know they really ain't shit. They know they ain't shit. And so when, the, when a man who, who appears to have some value starts expressing interest in her, she starts to think, wait a minute, wait a minute. Why does this dude not know that I'm a hoe? Why does this dude not know that I belong to the streets? There must be something wrong with him. It's the most. I mean, right. were they really simping for can you? Can I or say they something giving you the what you said? You want it? Do you know, a man only, you can only, <clears throat> you only feel like the woman is taking the man's role if the man is not providing and doing the masculine. Nah, being the oh, see, here we are. More sign language. Shame, insults, guilt, and the need to be right. So it's the man's fault that women are masculine. No, you guys are masculine because that's what the culture that's what the culture pushes you towards. It's not the man's fault. Sorry. Masculine. Do you know what I think? What does it Because a woman will automatically go into a feminine energy as soon as she finds that alpha male, whatever you want to call it. Do you know yeah, what I think? Why would, why, would, why would men provide traditionally when they don't get traditional women? Oh! Like, like mm. how, many, oh! how many of us are 22-year-old virgins oh! on here? Oh! Yeah. Oh, me, yeah. but it's also a part me? of the social me? culture me? as well. Me, me, me. Who the fuck said me? Influence. There's a lot of influence. I was a virgin. Right no, no, stop the cap. Oh, stop. You're a 22 year virgin. Look, 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 look. Sarah said, stop the cap. Yo, I like this fucking guy, Sarah. This guy. Right. Me, but it's also a part of the social culture as well. Me, me. There's a lot of influence. There's a lot of influence. I was a virgin. No, no, I stop the cap. Nah, he said, stop the cap. Stop the cap. <laughs> this is great. This is awesome, dude. Oh, I, 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 was, was, no, no, I was. No, there, I said R. I was. I said R. Okay. Do you know what I think the difference is? It doesn't is? matter. Oh, here we go. She says, how many How many of us are 22-year-old virgin? She asked the question. Not how many were, how many are. Four, if you're there. not now. <laughs> but you know, I think the Fuck out of here, <laughs> man. You were saying about women, like, back from his country want men to simp for them. I think the difference is because of the cultural difference. What you guys are listening now, what you guys are listening to, this is the difference between Pearl and Danica. This is the difference between Pearl and Danica, dude. Danica doesn't do this. All Danica does is shake her tits and her ass and tell niggas what they want to hear. And you thirsty niggas out here talking about, well, you need to call out Pearl too. For what? For what? Bringing us the truth, bringing us good content. Get out of here. <laughs> Unbelievable. No Go. cultural difference no, listen, in no, morals. Listen. Women's, listen. Women's he said, morals. stop the cat. Let me explain. Right. Let me explain. Right. Let me explain. Oh, look. Here comes, let, the, let hamster. Right? Here comes the hamster. Right? Here comes the hamster. this country. Because of the culture and the way women will get showered on, women, like I can go to a club and just get into a club and be on a man's table like that. Yeah, bingo. Right? Like so that. listen, so let me land. So let me land. Is that is so that a man simping for you though? No. That's not. But let no. me land. No, but it is. No, but let me land. But it is. But I tell you why it is. I, Marginally. If, uh, if I don't know you, yeah. no. I owe you absolutely but you nothing. Bingo. Let me see. That's let it. Me that's it. I owe you absolutely nothing. Goddamn as right. A man who doesn't know you. That's right. So what happens is the simp culture within. The Western world has become a norm. Yeah. So Woo! men will say, "Okay, cool." And this is why I speak to men. Men, I'm going to speak to you, right? <laughs> Yo, this because fucking if dude. you are out here with a lot of money, you may have a lot of money. Stop giving pretty women. Yeah. The, uh, stop giving pretty women attention. Yes. Because what happens is you will lose your resources, you will lose your money, mm -mm -mm. you will lose your time, and what will happen is they will take your time, effort resources, all the things that you built up, wow. and they'll be on to the next. You know oh, my God. So Yo, this dude, Sarah, this guy, this dude has all the game. Holy shit, man. Holy shit. Yeah, the level up, man, did I hear I was? Yeah, you. We listen, all girls were virgins at, at, at one point. Fuck out of here. I'll be Stop sleeping with the guy that ain't doing shit. Do you know what the Thank you. Thank you. The difference is the now, is now when you go out <laughs> and you can <laughs> spend a bag and buy a bottle, you're that guy now. No, but it's, I no. Can, do you know what? Do you know what? If I've got, wait, if, if wait, I've got, wait, if I've got money, you're right. Wait, 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 wait. This bitch is sitting here trying to convince us that she would get with a guy who's got money who's simping for her. No, they wouldn't. Fuck out of here. 30 racks and I spend on, one on. On, a, on, I like, could on a random um, girl. Hang on, I could be so, um, simping. Hang on, wait, wait, wait. Guys, wait, guys, 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 guys. Okay, this is this is a warning. Stop. Yeah. You, you can't be over talking the host. The host. It's, it's ruining right, the show. Please. The chat is picking up on it. You cannot be over talking right. the host. I could be a multimillionaire, right? But if I don't know you, Bingo. I have no obligation 
to be spending hundreds, thousands on you. There right? it is. The problem is in this generation when we're talking about simping, there are guys that are multi-millionaires, or maybe not even multi, they just got a little bit of money. Sure. And what they feel like doing, and it's for me, is like, th this shows men do not know how to get women without resources, Woo! right? Mm. They wow. They feel like their resources can get exactly. women, right? Resources gets women's attention. As they should. Resources get women's attention, guys. Listen, women are, again, they're biologically designed to seek out resources. This is a good thing. This is a good thing. We can't have, dude, we can't have women having babies with men who can't provide for them. That's just, that's just how that goes. That's just how that goes. Cool. And, and a lot of the time, it can because women love money. Sure. That, women like shiny mm -hmm. things, right? Well, yeah, that but too. if men understand, if you learn to focus on yourself and understand how to get women without resources, when you have the resources, Bingo. you oh understand that those resources, Yo. regardless of whether you have them Yo. or not, don't, it doesn't matter. You can still get women. But what <laughs> This guy... This guy is dropping straight bars. This is for all the black pill. Well, all you need to be is ripped, rich, and, 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 and handsome. Right? Yes. Looks, money, and status gets you, gets you plenty of opportunities with women. Looks, money, and status will get you more opportunities with women than if you didn't have them. Here's the difference. Here's the difference. If you don't have game... In other words, if you don't know how to handle women, you are now a target. You're now a target. Guys with looks, money, and status get pussy thrown at them all the time. All the time. But the men who understand how to handle women, meaning meaning they understand how modern women operate, those are the men who are the most successful with them. There are, dude, there are a lot of great-looking guys who are bad with women. There are a lot of men with status who are terrible with women. There are a lot of men with money who are bad with women. There ain't no doubt about it. There ain't no doubt about it. So if you're a man with money, looks, and status, but no game, you're not a high-value man. You are a target. You are a mark. And women pick up on this immediately. They pick up on this immediately. Men, women don't want to be with a man who don't know how to handle him. So they're like, okay, this guy's got a little bit of money and status. I'm going to milk this guy for all he's worth while I'm on the lookout for a man who has this guy's money and clout and status and fame, but also understands how to handle me as a woman. But the crux of that situation is, is that nine times out of ten, there's already a woman in his life, at which point they gladly become the side chick. Rolo says this all the time. Women would, women, dude, 11 out of 10 women would rather share a man of value than to have a low-value man all to themselves. These are facts. These are facts. Women would rather share a high-value man than to have a low-value man all to themselves. This is the epitome of hypergamy. Women are always looking for the best deal. They do not mind. They do not mind being one of many women. They have no problem with it at all. No problem with it at all. It's happened in this society. A man will have a watch on his hand, right? He'll have a chain on his neck, yep. right? He'll be at the club, yeah. he'll mm -hmm. buy multiple bottles, yeah. and he thinks, okay, cool, I'm going to get some women. Sure. I'm going to tell you, bro, stop doing that. Because mm. the bottom line is those women that you're trying to attract do not give a damn no. about you. Yeah, but then maybe don't. he don't give a damn either. Oh, maybe he don't give a damn either. Here we are. Here we are. It's always, it's always, back, it's always back to the sign language. That, that's around. what I'm trying to say. If I've got a fortune of, say, like, say I've got 50 racks. Now, say I blow one rack on girls in the club. That doesn't make a dent in what I have. No, but that's but you issue. look like, the, but you look like the guy that's mm. spending money. So just because you, cause you've just she spent is, enough to make you look... This is what this woman just said. <laughs> what this woman just said just tells you that women have no idea how men think. They have no idea how men think. Look like the guy. Uh, King Diaz with the $5 super chat. I appreciate that very much. Thank you, sir but not enough to dent like your value 
it's, your it's financial value. But that's what I'm Shake saying. Shake it, that's Nina. The today Shake that it, Nina. You, it has to be a cap to it. There has to be a cap to how much you ass. spend Shake on the, this random girl in the club to make you look like the man, but not the simp. Shake but that ass. Is, let me, let me, Shake on. that I ass. I have a question for the on, girls. Bro. If you really like a guy, do you, does it matter how much he spends on you? Like, no, you, if no, you no, really, no, if you, no. if you really, really no. like a guy, coffee date, not at all. Not at all. No, I believe that when I like a guy, I just. I, I care about his presence, mm -hmm. um, how he treats me, how he talks to me, oh, these things. Mm -hmm. blah, Obviously, blah, blah. as a girl, you do like the finer things in life or whatnot, but it's not what matters the most. Mm -hmm. For me personally, anyways. Money is easy. If oh, you she's have, still down there. If I you have a million pound in the bank and I give you a thousand pound, that's easy. Why if would I, I just give you a thousand? Do you see how she's just talking about giving away money? Only women would talk about just giving somebody money for no reason. That just proves that women don't really. It's very easy to talk about giving away money that you don't earn. Very, very easy.